So hey guys, I'm going to do a live show placing video for my show on uh, May 25th of this year. It was called Indian Paintbrush Live and I will get into this, but first, uh, just a little bit of background about the show. There was OF Peterstone Division, traditional size, OF Briar, traditional size, custom, all scaled together, and artist resin all scaled together, and then there was fun classes. And so those are the divisions, um, and I said the two most competitive divisions was custom and artist resin. So any custom placings I got I was very happy with because that was an extremely competitive class. So, but, uh, division. But before I go into my placings, I'm going to show you the three horses I got at the show. Um, so first horse I got was this 2017 single day stable mate on the quarter horse mold. So that is her. I think her name's like Anna or something like that. Um, and then on Instagram, I won a, a giveaway, but like the person who was holding the giveaway was going to the show. So I figured instead of like having her ship the horse to me, I just pick him up at the show. And this is him. Um, he is extremely detailed. Um, and then I got this Marawari custom. I have uh, same artist who did him. Um, I've I bought him from her. I love this dude so much. So that are these three guys. Um, these two you'll see later on in the video because I showed them. And then I got her at the end of the show. So I didn't have time to show her, but that's okay. So in the custom full division, this little girl took a sixth place. In the draft division, um, draft class, I can't remember exactly, I think he was either in Clydesdale or Shire, but either one, he he managed to get 6th place. Um, Illumination, he is the Nakoda decorator, um, see-through or clear wear with like um, the Patriot horse in his decorator division, he took 6th place. And mints and then the fantasy classes and decorated classes were also nan qualified. In other draft OF mini class, um, this girl took a sixth place. I'm not sure yet about what breed I'm going to show her officially as, and this is Matt Fault, by the way. Um, this little dude, who is a regular run from a few years ago, took a sixth place in his class. He finally placed for me. Um, Ash is his bar name, but he's my custom half laner fjord, and, um, the artist finally did sign him, uh, she was so excited to get him to me that she figured out to sign him. Uh, I don't know. But he took a sixth place in his custom pony class. Very, very proud of him for taking that uh, sixth place. This little girl I call Rose, but her uh, OF name is Quickstep. She took a sixth place in her stock full class. This dude, who is the chalky war paint Indian pony version, took a sixth place in his class, finally. He, he's an off and on horse. Sometimes he places, sometimes he don't. So these are all the six place horses. And then my three that I got the show, I will move on to fifth places now. Moving on to fifth places, but before I do that, I forgot I did actually get one more horse at the show. I got the Mini Villegro. So I picked him up. I got this weird sudden urge to conga this mold, and I'm missing one now. I bought all of them. Not at the show, but I got two more later on. But yeah, so I got Mini Belegra. Okay, so here are all my fifth place horses. I'll start down here. This is a stallion from one of the mystery full sets that they came out with. Took a fifth place in his Mustang class. Um, this is from a Haldago series. Um... Don't know exactly which one, but she took a fifth place in her class. Um, this is a foal from one of the mystery foals. I'm not sure which foal or which mom and dad she has, but either way, she took a fifth place. Um, this girl is from a Gentle Giants series. She took a fifth place, and I was gonna, wasn't even going to show her, but I had room, and she is LSQ. The seller said she was body quality. Um, um, this is a collecte, uh, modeled after the 
Mongolia Macador, I believe is how you pronounce his breed. That's who he's modeled after. Um, but he took a fifth place in his class. Moving up here, this is Anna, I believe is how you pronounce her name, from uh, a Mus American Mustang series set. Um, she took a fifth place. Don't know about her. I'm keeping her breed quite yet. Um, this is Glossier Firm. Um, he looks really orange in camera, but he is not. But he took a fifth place. Um, this is my Glossy Indu from Briarfest 2017. He took a fifth place. This is the Palomino Marawari. He took a fifth place, which was quite surprising because there's a lot of Nazrudans, including one of mine, but yeah, he managed to take a fifth place. I don't think any Nazru Nazrudans placed in that class. Um, this is Little LaFire. Um, he is the original LaFire. He is not the reissue. You can tell by the coloration, and he does not have a VIN mark on the bottom of his foot. Um, because the Vins came out before, came out after he, the original set was released. But anyway, he took a fifth place. Um, this is Bluebell. She took a fifth place. And then this is, uh, I believe her name is Bella. She is the unicorn web special half leaner mare in full. And she took a fifth place in her class. So, these are the fifth placers and now we'll move on to fourth places i couldn't remember if i said this or not but this little girl i think it's a girl took a fifth place in her custom deco class she is modeled after the, the transgender flag okay so moving on to fourth places i had three traditionals and three mini place um, i didn't get that many fourth places but that's okay i don't really go to shows to get placing i just go to have fun and meet new people and if i place i place okay anyway moving on first horse well first horse didn't get a first place but first horse i'm picking up is argyle um he took a fourth place um can't remember what class i showed him i'm pretty sure i showed him as a shire um this girl this is alba she is the new tractor supply 80th anniversary horse um, came out last year. She took a fourth place. Um, this girl, this is, I call her daughter, but this is the Fun Fools Red Run Mare Wixom from like 2009. Um, she took a fourth place. Really happy for her. And then moving on to the three minis that place. This is the, I call her Nyx, but um, this is a blind bag unicorn. I think she is my favorite from series two. Um, love the coloring, love Briar bringing back the dark colored unicorns. But anyway, she took a fourth place. Um, this little girl, she is a parade of breeds, um, special run, what do you want to call it? She is a laying down full, but she took a fourth place. And then this girl, this, she really doesn't have an OF name, it's just called the Highland Pony, but she took a fourth place as well. These are all my fourth place horses, moving on to third places. So here are all my third place horses. And like I said, Pebbles were with um, mini, we were considered minis, so like he was with the traditional ponies. Anyway, these are all my third place horses. Certain down here so I don't forget him like I did his little buddy. This is, oh I call him gay, but um, this is a pride pony modeled off the, the gay rainbow flag. And he took a third in his custom decorator mini class. This is another one I call, this is Rose. I also call her Rose. I know I have two horses named Rose, but that's not their show names. But uh, this girl took a third place. She always surprises me. Um, the artist who painted her actually was going to strip her if nobody bought her because she didn't like her. And she's been doing really well for me ever since I bought her. Um, this is Mini Justify. She took a third place in her class. And that was a huge, huge, like, uh, thoroughbred class. This is the Twin Palomino Foal on the Ashley Mold. Took her, took a third place. This is the Clydesdale Mare. She took a third place. Um, this is Glossy Heartbreaker. He always does really good. He took a third place. This girl... Don't really know what to say about her, but she is the new Bay Pinto Pony. She took a third place. I think I got a good breed for her. She always takes third places, but 
that's okay. Um, she places. I'm happy. This is, uh, oh, I call him Deja Vu. This guy is a precious stone horse. He took third place. Only three horses in the class, but I'm not complaining. This is Flower. She is a custom. Not, none of these customs in this video are done by me. She took a third place in her class, and I think it was a fairly decent sized class. Um, this girl is, I forgot her, oh, oh, oh uh, I forgot her OF name, but in her class, she took a third place. And then this is a classic Halloween horse by the name of Mischief Knight. And in his fun Halloween horse class, he took a third place. I took him for the fun class, basically. So these are all my third place horses. Moving on to second place horses, those horses got nan cards. So these are all my second place horses, and these guys all got nan cards with their um, second place. So starting off, this is Creamsicle. Took a second place. Um, this is uh, Leah's Fancy Briar. There's literally only two horses in her class, so she took a second place by default. Um, she would have not placed if she... Uh, uh, was up against more horses because she is not in the best of shape. I literally just took her along to see what would happen. Um, the really only Amber I'm going to really start thoroughly throwing my show chain and showing is her. Um, this is another surprise uh, foal. I don't know what family she comes from, but she took a second place. This is the twin Palomino Morgan. Well, not Morgan. She's a twin Palomino foal. Um... There are twin, the reason why I say this is because there's Morgans on this mold, but uh, she took a second place. This is um, Mozart. He is a unicorn foal uh, from that web special series with the half lunar mare. He took a second place. Um, this little dude, he's a collect a gypsy banner, took a second place. This little guy is another mystery foal. Not sure what his mom and dad are, but he took a second place. This is a shellac unicorn foal. It's only two horses here in the class, so she took second place by default. This is the Series 1 Mini Alborozo um, unicorn. Took a second place. I believe the dark blue chase figure of that Series 1 took first place. Um, this little guy... Was really surprised. He's a stallion from one of the mystery full sets. Took a second place in his class. I was extremely surprised by that. These guys are all my second place horses. Move on to first place horses and name cards. And here are all my first place horses. Starting down here. This is a vintage wood grain family Arabian foal. She is from the 1960s, I believe. She took a first place. Um, there was no other decorator of traditional size foals, so she took the only one. I thought there was going to be more, but that's okay. Uh, this is the Clydesdale full. She took a first place. This is my child. This is Glossy Gigi Valentine. She took a first place and an ink card, and this is her ninth ink card. Um, so here she is. I don't really like to touch her a lot because of her gloss, and I don't want her to become de-glossy. Um, this is John Wayne's Duke. He is a Shatractor Supply horse from, from like 2006 or seven, I believe. Took a first place in an iron card. Back up here. Um, this is the Mythical Pegasus Surprise Model, Treasure Hunt. Um, his other Wayne is here. He took, here's his other Wayne. He took a first place. I don't like to lay him down on his Wayne. I don't want to break it. Um, this little girl, she's a regular run from quite a few years ago. She took a first place. Um, this little girl, she's itty bitty. She took a first place. Um, this girl, don't really know a lot about her. Some people say that she's a one of a kind. Some people say she's a daw, but she has no like symbolism of a daw, so I don't know. But either way, she took a first place. Um, go down here, then we'll work, work our way up. This little girl I was very surprised. It's a huge like other mixed class, and she took a first place. Um, this little girl, this is a donkey schleich figure. She took a first place, so she was the only donkey in the class, so she is the only one that was there. This is another mystery full stallion. Don't know his mate or his baby, but he took a first place. Um, told you you would see these two again. This is the custom giveaway horse that I won that I picked up. 
picked up at the show and I threw him in a class and in a huge like other sports pattern class he took a first place the judge loved him was like raved about him this guy and the other custom class he took a first place I technically missed his class that he was supposed to go in but that's okay so this is my first place horses and then moving on to my division reserves and division champions so these are my four um, winners these I got three division champions and one reserve champion so this little cutie um, got a division reserve champion of the whole mini OF Briar full division um, I think he is like I said I think he's a from like a set I know he came with a Pasifino chest like paint um, from like 2007 I believe um, this dude um, my mythical Pegasus took a division champion. She ran out of these ribbons, so she just gave, uh, improvised and gave him that. This girl, very surprised, love her though. She took a division champion. Um, um, I got her from a good friend of mine, and I'm so glad because I've won this horse for a while, and I'm so glad she does well. Um, Itty Bitty here surprised me. She took a division champion. Um, he took division champion of the whole fantasy division. His classes, it's kind of confusing, but yeah. Took division champion of the whole gated Spanish division. And she took division champion of the whole light division. So these are these guys. I have one more placing to show you. I got a, I completed a showing grill dish at this show and I will show you guys that in a minute. So I call it showing grill, but it's technically called showing goal. But anyway, one of these was to one someday win an overall champion, and Itty Bitty here did that for me. She won me my first overall champion. So like I said, she took a first place Nan card in her class, won division champion of the whole light division, and then she won overall champion of the whole OF Briar mini division. So she got this nice little rosette, and then she got this paintbrush with overall champion, and then it said the show on it. So, yeah, that was such an amazing placing. I was so happy. I was so proud of my little girl. I wasn't even expecting to get anything this good, and I couldn't be even more happier. And so, yeah, that will conclude my showing uh, my live placings video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, I just want to start a conversation down below. Just comment down below and I will get right back to you guys. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.